Hey there, it's uh, Jeffrey Douglas, SD Rover. Hope your day is going well. I'm out on Fiesta Island. It's May Gray in San Diego. And today I want to do just a first impressions video of uh, my new camp light. So uh, this is just a first impressions video. I will do another video once I've had some time to actually use the, um, the light in different camping situations. As always, this is not sponsored. I purchased this with my own money. So here's a couple of details about this light that I think uh, makes it kind of unique. Now, if you're, if you're watching a lot of uh, overlanding YouTubers, uh, the Light Ranger is all the rage right now, and uh, I've got a buddy that's got one, and, and they are really bright and do a great job of really lighting up the whole campsite. So over the last uh, five years, I'm getting to the point where I got so much stuff that I'm trying to really downsize my kit and go with lighter things that take up less room. And um, so while this doesn't stand alone uh, very tall, I still think it's something that you want to look at. So I want to talk to you about some of the things that make uh, this a little bit unique. One of them first is your ability to take and just push a button on the bottom and that pops open the uh, three legs so it's very stable uh, on a tabletop. Uh, the legs also have magnets on them and uh, that will stick to uh, metal so I'll show you that in a bit. If you're putting this on the hood of a car, it's, it's got enough room uh, for the light to get up and out of your eyes. So I kind of like that. So here's a light uh, switch and you just hold that and that will bring on the light. And then you can cycle through the different brightnesses. So the swivel head is really unique in that you can, you can swivel it 360 degrees and then about 175 degrees or so upwards and backwards. So you can point this up, you can point it down, you can twist it around. Makes it really very useful. And perhaps one of the more interesting things about this light is it's magnetic. So if you wanted to, if you're working down at night and you need to do some work on the engine bay, you could uh, use this as a work light. Just clicks on like that. You can pull this out then, and you can direct the light kind of wherever you want it to go. The other thing I could do is put it up on the tailgate, and uh, that gives me kind of the same uh, situation as a uh, light ranger. Uh, the last thing that's kind of cool is uh, it can work just as a standard flashlight. So I'm going to sneak a couple of uh, shots uh, I took out in the desert when I was using the lamp on a picnic table, uh, give you an idea what that looks like. Uh, when I get to my uh, longer term review, we'll do more uh, insights of uh, the light in action. Just wanted to do this very brief uh, video to give you an idea of the functionality of this. So thanks for spending a couple minutes with me. If you found this useful, please consider liking or subscribing to the channel if you like uh, overlanding gear, traveling photography video. Uh, if you see me out and about, please stop and say hi. And uh, remember, get outside.